Hi, I'm Mark McPherson. And I'm Emily Tiara, and welcome to our market update. With spring just around the corner, we're expecting a few busy months ahead. The Reserve Bank has again cut interest rates to a historic low of 1.5%. Sellers who have held off will start to come onto the market. Did you know that you've only got four weeks to put your property on the market if you want it sold and settled before Christmas? That's right, Emily. We believe any seller should be on the marketplace sooner rather than later, as stock levels continue to be increasingly low. Keep in mind, the more competition on the market, the less likelihood of securing a premium price. If you are considering making the move and taking advantage of the current conditions, then we should be meeting and discussing a plan towards maximising your property. In the month of June, we experienced horrific storms and some of the coldest winter mornings. However, our buyers were not deterred by these conditions. The auction of 43 Brook Street Coogee soared with the home selling for $2,426,000 and 13 Norton Street Kingsford sold for $2,350,000, which was a huge 450k over reserve. Our days on market averaged around eight days with feature sales including 1 slash 4 Beach Street Clovelly selling for $1,575,000 and 10 slash 44 Bream Street Coogee which sold for $1,305,000. The last time we traded this apartment was in 2011 for $772,000. That's half a million dollars in capital growth. Both these properties were scheduled for an auction campaign. However, the high buyer demand resulted in both of these properties selling within a week of being on the market and achieving building records. We have continued to see record numbers of familiar faces at open homes and we're working very closely with a strong list of quality buyers who have been frustrated with the lack of opportunity. This is a true indication that this year we're experiencing the lowest stock levels in the beachside and parkside suburbs. Thanks for watching our market update and we hope you enjoyed it.